My family was sad because we couldn't go on a trip to another country. We had our passports but forgot to get our visas. I just think that's just a sign that maybe we weren't supposed to leave. To make everyone feel better, my husband and I took the kids to get some candy and then we all went on a really tall Ferris wheel where you can see the entire city at night from up there. While we were up in the Ferris wheel, weird things started happening at our house. We rushed home because we were worried a coyote might get inside. When we got back, it was dark. My husband and I went in to check the house and left the kids in the car. You guys stay inside. Walk the door okay my husband saw something odd and we ran back to the car to get the kids but then something even more strange happened don't forget to like and subscribe you guys are never gonna guess what marco and i did when we were in san diego a couple days ago we completely forgot everything in the bathroom so i lost my dyson he lost his clippers i lost my straightener and we were like wondering like hmm did somebody come in there and take it where where did our stuff go so marco I and i are hat squad right now it. we're like we gotta get some new clippers and hair tools to do our hair have you ever been on a ferris wheel no guess where we're going today what are we going on the biggest ferris wheel in the world what? What? Isn't that cool? <laughs> say what kaden are you ready to go on the biggest ferris wheel in the world He's just down for the ride. At least he's up, guys. Can we give a round of applause for Nugget for staying awake in the car? He's Why are we going here? Well, I thought it would be nice. They missed the trip that I booked them. So I just feel like it's only right that we give them something in return to have some fun because they were really expecting to be on vacation. I'm scared. You're scared of what? What's the what's there to be scared of when Mommy and Daddy and Braylon and Caden are by your side? Well, that's so creepy. I feel like I'm gonna fall. Wait till you see it, it's really cool. Sophia is here from the Beverly Hall family with her beautiful family. Hi guys! We're inside of Caesar's Palace. This is our little cheat code so that way we could walk across to the link, which is where we're going for the big Ferris wheel. I believe it's that way. You don't know where we're going. We gotta go to the front that way. Come oh on, my man. god. Okay, Mr. Hall, I see you. I see you. You know where we were going. Oh, there's a the Ferris wheel right there. Right? Do you see it? That's where we're going. We have to get all the way to the big Ferris wheel. It's going to take like 100 miles. Gene, that's big. <laughs> Why is he holding his leg up like that? <laughs> that's a cool dude. What's going dude? on, dude? He got his slug hat on. He's so chilling. scared. What are you scared of? The Ferris wheel. Yeah, it's not compared to a bigger tree. The hugest tree that we just saw. I think maybe you're not understanding how big this thing is then. Because if you think that a tree is bigger than this Ferris wheel, you're mistaken. Oh. When we get to the top of that Ferris wheel, the trees are going to look like pebbles. I'm scared. That's so huge. It is. is it huge than a sphere? It is taller than the sphere. Stay right behind your dad, okay? There's a lot of traffic. We have to be safe. When I say Marco, you say Polo. Marco. Polo. Marco. Somebody died. Whoa. It was the night. His hands are jumped off. <gasps> Look at this traffic. We only got 12 seconds to get across, y'all. Eight seconds, y'all. Eight seconds. Come on. Whoa. Eight seconds. Hey, hey. <laughs> hey. Oh my god. Ten. It is huge. Hey, ticket nugget. Before we head to the big Ferris wheel, we decided to stop at I Love Sugar to calm the boy's nerves. Well, really just Cannon's nerves because I think he's the only one that's really scared to get on this thing. This store has every kind of candy you can imagine. I Love Sugar isn't just any candy store. They're great at thinking up new and fun ideas and have lots of special designs. This has to be the biggest dum dum I've ever seen in my life. Wow, that know. is so humongous. Actually, Marco might be the biggest. <laughs> oh, really? Let us know in the comments which one is your favorite, but my favorite is root beer. My no, favorite has always been cotton, cotton oh candy. Oh my, there's a mystery. I wonder what this tastes like. I like that, Cannon. I'll probably get this one. I like these. You like those? I like the black Twizzlers. Why you like the black Twizzlers? Because Jen Ortega like the black color. Oh, oh Jen Ortega eating on your color. I'm going to drink her out. I got all the good it wasn't long until we all found something that we loved. Candy. Candy. Yay. Jaden <laughs> got him a nice charm sweet pop. That's what him want. Yay. 
Yay! Once we got all of our favorite sugar treats, we did a little checkout dance to celebrate. Cannon celebrated a little bit too hard and knocked his lollipop off the stick, but it's okay, I fixed it. Let me know in the comments, what's your favorite candy and what would you have brought home from this store? Now we're headed over to the high roller. Are you guys ready? Yeah! Hey, some my heart. Oh, you are. You're a true champion. Let's go. Go, 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 go. That was spooky, wasn't it? That was kind of hard. I think we get the whole thing through ourselves. Hey! We're going to go high. 150 feet. They didn't go get scared. Why are you locking right there? So he can see everything. Not Marco literally being afraid. I am scared of high. I'm not scared. I'm not afraid of heights or nothing. Yeah. Wow, guys, we're not even to the top yet. <laughs> I don't know if this makes sense right now, but we went from seeing normal sized things that we usually see to just seeing miniature things. Everything is tiny down there. Holy crap. This thing goes slow. Yeah, no. It's like we're really high. We're up here with the aliens, guys. You gotta look out here and see if you see me. Miss, be quiet. Why are you saying that? We don't need to know nothing up this high. We're not gonna fall all the way down, Mark Cannon. Don't scare me like that, buddy. Okay? Now you're scaring daddy. You are chicken, Dad. Look at how small we are. Look. Well, that's where we were at. I guess when you look all the way down there, whoa, I wish the water show. The water show's playing and it looks so small. Wow, look at the water show. Would you guys do this? Like and subscribe. I would do it. Would you do this again? Ten, They're gonna come nine, down! Eight, seven! Six! Five! Four! four three, three! Two! One! Two, one. Woo! We're at the top, guys! This is so nice! Oh my god. That was really cool. Don't fall asleep in the sky! Oh my god! What the hell is it? He's like, uh-uh, I'm cold! Look at that sphere. Everything is just so big and bright. What? Oh my God. What? Look at this. Oh my God. We should go in the hotel. It's almost off, man. Go, 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 go. See who up in here. I'm knocking them out with this bag. Come on. Marco, I don't want to. I go got in to. There. Come on. You coming with me, man? You Come on. Open the doors. What if, what if something happens to both of us? Man, nothing's gonna happen. I'm not. Come on, bro. Come on. Are you guys okay? No, we're not. We gotta get these kids. They don't want us. Come on. You guys stay inside. Lock the door, okay? You hear that? It sounds like a like a coyote or something is loud. Marco, I don't want to go in. Come on, look. No. Marco. Oh my God. I really whole family. Don't ever do. Alien is gone. Do oh. Alien is gone. Is that why it's so dark? It feels cold. <sighs> why is the only thing? I'm scared. Marco, 
the kids. Somebody has to stay with the kids. <laughs>